Alrighty guys, so here we go. We have science diet, adult, chicken, and rice formula versus taste of the wild, high prairie, which is a lamb, bison, formula, kind of those are those proteins. And let's go ahead, dive down, do our three hour time lapse and see where we're at on the other side. Alrighty, let's go. Alrighty guys, if you have not yet subscribed, please go ahead, smash that subscribe button. Don't forget to hit the little bell so you get the notifications of our next video. Also, you can always hit me up on Instagram at Adam, your dog trainer, and you can follow me there. And actually you'll see a lot of my students pictures on my Instagram page. So please go ahead, check that out if you get a moment. I'll see you guys later. Alrighty guys, so as always, I started reading the ingredients of both bags. This way you get an idea of what we end up finding out at the end. It makes a little more sense. So we're gonna start out with the High Prairie uh, Taste of the Wild formula. So let's go ahead, dive into that. Let me flash that ingredients up on the screen there. And we're gonna start with bison, lamb meal, chicken meal, egg product, sweet potatoes, peas, uh, potatoes, canola oil, uh, roasted bison, roasted venison, and all natural flavoring, tomato pumice, ocean fish, salt, and a bunch of other stuff that's kind of in the mix there. So let's go ahead and that was the Taste of the Wild. Let's take a look at the Science Diet Adult Formula Chicken. Alrighty. So that one happens to be chicken byproduct meal, brewer's rice, whole grain wheat, whole grain corn, powdered cellulose, soy bean meal run, animal fat preserved with citric acid and tayo, I don't even know what that word is, um, dried egg product, chicken liver, flavoring, soybean meal, lanic acid, flaxseed, and then a bunch of other little chemical stuff. So those are our two ingredient listings for the mashup today. Let's go ahead, get down into our three hours. See you guys down low. Alrighty guys, back at it again. This week's mashup will be Science Diet Adult Chicken Formula versus Taste of the Wild High Prairie Adult. So two adult foods. So let's go ahead, dive in. Let's put our two cups of water into our fourth of a cup of dog food. One fourth of a cup. Pour the water in our trusted Eagles glasses. They're not doing so hot this year, sadly. And we're gonna go with lime juice. And we're gonna do a fourth of a teaspoon. I was requested that I measure this, so I am. Fourth of a cup fourth of a cup and I actually had a lot of people ask me why I add the lime juice well this is to just add an acid base to the water so this way it helps break it down a little faster so let's see how this looks after three hours already I'll see you guys on the other side Alrighty guys, so let's go ahead and dive into the science diet first. This is the chicken uh, formula. And let's get a nice close -y look of that. You can really see how it expanded and hasn't really even broken down at all. You can actually see, still see my finger through the bottom there. And there's a lot of residue right up here around the brim. Uh, the one main concern is these kibbles really expanded, probably two to three times bigger. And if I swirl this around, I don't know if it will zoom in enough, you can actually see those byproducts kind of on the brim there. So that was the um, solid goal. Now let's go into Taste of the Wild, which as you see, yeah, we do have a few bubbles on top here. It's actually expected. 
um, a few but not a lot and the breakdown is pretty good you can't really see I mean I guess you can see my finger through um, but we did have some kibbles fall to the bottom these kibbles didn't really expand they're actually breaking down in the water which is really good um, and if I swirl this around it's not so bad on the we don't see a lot of buildup we just see a lot of the crumbs which is kind of cool you know so you know there's a huge difference when you're dealing with foods that have byproducts and foods that don't have byproducts you know as we read the ingredient listing we found that the all natural food taste of the wild had no corn no wheat no soy no byproducts no artificial coloring and then science diet which is that all science hoopla in there has a lot of those things a lot of fillers um, and I'm just not really impressed with science diet and how much it expands because then that makes your dog falsely feel like they're full when really it's just the food expanding in their gut um, I'm gonna have to give this one to the taste of the wild and yeah I'll see you guys next time everyone have a great week we got a lot of videos coming up in the next couple months because of the holidays so let's get ready to rock and roll it's gonna be a fun month have a good one everybody have a good day. Deuces.